Good morning, students. Welcome to online classes. In the previous session, we have discussed STC rule, how to make a formula. So, in this session, we have discussed formula of T ratio using STC. Formula of T ratio means uh, we have made formula 90 minus theta, 90 plus theta, 180 minus theta, 180 plus theta, 270. So, different types of formula we can be learn. So, in this session, we have to make formula of T ratio using ASTC. As you know, in previous session, we have discussed what is the ASTC rule. ASTC rules means, as you know, as the plane is divided into four parts, and each part is called quadrant. And that is first quadrant, second quadrant, third, and fourth. First quadrant is lies between 0 to 90. Or we can say uh, 90 is called pi by 2 in radial form, and uh, second quadrant which lies between 90 to 180, that is we can say 180 is pi. Okay, so it lies between second quadrant 90 to 180, and 90 to 270. So 180 to 270, that is 3 pi by 2. 3 pi by 2 is 270. Is ready? 270 is converted to radian, that is 3 pi by 2. 180 to 270, that is third quadrant, and 270 to 360 is fourth quadrant. So, 0 to 90, the first quadrant is a positive angle because we can make rotation in anti clockwise direction, so it is a positive angle. Okay, so STC rules means here A S T C STC rule. F for all positive and S for sine and sine is related to that is cosec. So sine and cosec are positive and the third quadrant that is T T for tan. Tan is related to quads of tan and quad are positive and the fourth quadrant is lies in cos. So cos and is related to sec. Both are reciprocal to each other, so cos and sec both are positive in fourth quadrant if we take in positive angles. Okay, so here we have to make a formula that is T ratio of first we have to learn T ratios T ratio of minus theta using of dodge theta. So T ratio of minus theta of or we can say in terms of in terms of those theta. So now we make a formula <coughs> minus theta. So we uh, make a formula of minus theta. So first as you know 0 to 90 is first quadrant or we can say 0 to pi by 2 is first quadrant. So 0, if it is anti clockwise, then positive angles. If we take no, clockwise, then it is negative angles. Okay. So we we'll, so 0 to 90, that is first quadrant. 90 to 180, that is second quadrant. 182 to 270, that is third quadrant, and it is also 270 to 360, that is fourth quadrant. So, here we will take a make a tricks here that is in 90 related, 90 related, that is alternate 90 and the opposite of 90 is 270, so it is also an alternate. Okay, to learn the formula, to make a formula too easy, so we uh, 90 related are alternate and 270 related. Alternate. Okay, and here 0 equivalent to 360, so 0 is same, and here 5 or 180 is also same because opposite of 0 is 180. So both are same. What do you mean by same and alternate? Same means, same means, uh, suppose. Same means sin theta, you can make a formula sin theta, that means it is a sine form. It is called same. Alternate means 
if we take sign then in alternate mode you can write your cos okay so same means given value and the result value is same sign sign cos cos tan tan cot cot sec sec cos sec cos that are all same in sense of same okay alternate means you could take sign then you can write cos it will cos then it sign tan cot cot tan sec cos sec and cos sec sec so alternate means are sign if you take sign then the result are cos if we take tan the result are cot if we take sec the result are cos sec okay so now we write some formula here so t ratio of minus theta now minus theta means you can write zero minus theta is also minus theta so zero minus theta means it lies in clockwise direction so it is lies in fourth quadrant minus theta is lies in fourth quadrant so how to make formula here the so sine of minus theta cos of minus theta tan of minus theta cot of minus theta sec of minus theta and as you know there, there are six tiers you are there so your sin cos tan cot sec and cos sec okay now sin of minus theta as you minus theta means zero minus theta so zero minus theta is a negative angle so it lies in fourth quadrant in fourth quadrant so zero related is same first we have to know zero zero is related to same same means here sin so we can write directly sin theta okay sin because zero is related to same so zero minus theta so we can write sin of minus theta is sin theta then we put this sign sign means is positive or negative so here zero minus theta lies in fourth quadrant in fourth quadrant cos and sec are positive but here we take sign so that is negative so sign of minus theta is minus sin theta similarly cos of minus theta first we have take minus theta means zero minus theta and zero it is a zero related so in zero related that is same same means if we take cos that is cos same means if we take cos then the result also cos so here we put cos theta now put this sign sign means zero minus theta is lies in fourth quadrant fourth quadrant cos and so it are positive so here it cos so it is positive so we write directly cos theta okay similarly tan of minus theta that is minus tan theta cot of minus theta minus cot theta sec of minus theta sec theta because in fourth quadrant fourth quadrant but in case of zero minus theta zero minus theta is lying in fourth quadrant so in negative angle it is a first quadrant okay so cosec of minus theta is minus cosec theta so these are the formula regarding minus theta minus theta or we can say zero minus theta now take an example suppose sin of minus 30 degree sin of minus 30 degree so we apply this formula sin of minus theta form your given question is in the form of sin of minus theta so sin of minus 30 is minus sin okay so that equal to minus sin that the value of sin 30 is 1 by 2 so the answer is minus so sin of minus 30 is minus half. okay now take another example suppose cos of minus 60 can you define the value of cos of minus 60 cos of minus 60 here we take because cos of minus theta is cos theta in case of minus theta only cos and sec are positive and all are, are negative so cos of minus 60 is cos theta that will be cos 60 and the value of cos 60 is also so cos of minus 60 is 1 by 2 answer so these are the formula regarding minus theta in terms of cos theta okay now 
we put another formula that is 90 minus theta t ratio of so this is the second category t ratio of 90 minus theta in terms of choice theta so now we make formula 90 degree minus theta cos 90 minus theta then 90 degree minus theta or we can say 10 pi by 2 minus theta okay we write in degree form you can also write in the radial form also so your cot 90 degree minus theta cot say and the last one is cos say we write in a systematic order now how to write a formula using ASTC first we have to know which is related to 90 degree here we see in a 90 degree related are alternate alternate means if the cursor is signed then you can write in the alternate alternate means cos so sign if we take uh, 90 related or alternate so we write sign alternate of sign is cos theta okay now for this sign 90 degree minus theta 90 minus theta that means 90 less so 90 less is lies in fourth corner 90 minus theta is lies in first quadrant. In first quadrant, all are positive. So all these formula are positive. So sin 90 minus theta is cos theta. Similarly, cos 90 minus theta as 90, 90 related are alternate. So cos is sin theta. As you know, all are positive. So we can write all are positive. So tan alternate of tan is cos theta. Cos theta is tan theta sec is cosec cosec is sec okay so these are the formula regarding 90 minus theta in terms of cos theta now take an example sin 30 degree as you know the value of sin 30 is 1 by 2 but we can make formula in regarding 90 minus theta so sin 30 degree can be write as sin 90 degree minus 60 if we subtract 90 minus 60 that is 30 so we can write 30 in terms of 90 degree minus 60 so we can apply this formula sin 90 degree minus theta that is cos theta so here cos 60 so in this formula we have learned sin 30 is also equal to cos 60 and that is equal to 1 by 2 so here we can write sin 30 is equal to cos 60 that is equal to 1 by 2 because sin 30 is the same value of cos 60 okay so these are the formula regarding 90 degree minus theta in terms of cos theta now we proceed to next formula that is third term d ratio of 90 degree plus theta in terms of cos theta so here we write in third category and all are the 90 degree plus theta related formula okay so sine 90 degree plus theta as you know 90 related to so 90 related formula is alternate so here we write cos theta so 90 plus theta 90 plus theta means 90 above so it lies in for second quarter 90 degree plus theta is lies in four second quadrant. In second quadrant, sine and cosine are positive and others is t ratio are negative. So here sine here the given value is sine, so the value is positive. Okay. So here cos 90 plus theta, as you know, 90 related are alternate. So here cos is sine. So here the negative because cos sine and cos are positive in second quadrant but here cos so it is negative and similarly you can write 10 90 minus which is related to 90 so it is you can write cot theta minus of cot theta minus of 10 theta minus of cosec theta and the last one is sec theta 
Why we write a positive in last formula that is cosec 90 plus theta cosec 90 because cosec and sine are positive. Cosec and sine are positive and others are negative in second quadrant because 90 plus theta is lies in second quadrant. So in second quadrant, as you know, 90 related are alternate, so we write all these are in the form of alternate. Okay. Alternate means sine we given the value of sine, then the answer is cos, cos, then sine, tan is cot, cot is tan, sec is cos, and cos is sec. So these are the formula related 90 degree plus theta. Now we write the next category that is for t ratio of 180 degree minus theta in terms of the okay so here we write all this formula regarding 180 degree minus theta so here first is sin 180 minus theta so here the value is 180 related so in 180 related that is same same means if we take sin then the answer is sin also okay same means if we take sin then answer is sin if we take cos then answer is cos okay so same means sin 180 related that is sin theta and 180 minus theta means 180 less so 180 minus theta is also lies in second quarter. That means 90 plus theta is also second quarter. Or 180 minus theta also lies in second quarter. Okay. So in second quarter, sin and cosec are positive. So here sin is positive. Okay. So similarly, minus cos theta, minus tan theta, minus cot theta, minus sec theta, and the last one is cosec theta. First and last are positive because 180 minus theta is second one. In second quadrant, sine and cosec are positive. So here we write sine and cosec are positive and all these are negative. But here we write in uh, 180 related of same. So we write all these T ratio in the form of same value that is sine, that is sine, cos, cos. Okay. So these are the formula regarding 180 minus theta. Now proceed to formula number 5 and that is T ratio of 180 plus theta in terms of dot theta. So here we write 180 plus theta. Okay. So how we write 180 plus theta? Formula 180 plus theta. So here 180 related formula is same. So here we write same. That is sine theta. So 180 plus theta means 180 plus theta is lies 180 above. So 180 above means it lies in third quadrant. And in third quadrant, tan and cot are positive and others are negative. So here sine 180 plus theta is sine theta and the cos 180 plus theta. Sorry, the sine the sine of the sine theta is sin 180, 180 related to the same, so here I, we write sin and 180 plus theta is lies in third quadrant, third quadrant, tan and cot are positive, but here sin, so it is negative. Similarly, cos 180 plus theta is minus cos theta, but tan and cot are positive in third quadrant, so here we write only tan theta and here is cot theta and the sec theta is minus sec theta and the last one is minus cos theta. Here only two tan and cot are positive because 180 plus theta related lies in third quadrant and third quadrant tan and cot are positive. So here tan and cot are positive and other four t ratios are negatives. So these are the formula of 180 degree plus theta in terms of those theta. So next we can write another formula that is 270 related 
So here we will write 270 degree minus theta. Similarly, we can write 270 plus theta, 360 minus theta, 360 plus theta. So here we will write 270 minus theta. So sin 270 degree minus theta cos 270 minus theta times 270 minus theta these are the degree form you can also write in the radian form that means you can write in 3 pi by 2 So here, you can add 270 or 3 pi by 2, those are the same. It is your degree form and then it is a radian form. Sin 270 minus theta, in 270 related, you can see in the STC rule, 270 degree related, it is alternate, alternates means if we take sin then it is cos theta. Then we put the sin, sin means 270 minus theta, 270 less and it lies. 270 minus theta it lies between third quadrant. In third quadrant, 10 and quarter are positive. So here the value is negative. Similarly, cos 270 minus theta is it is alternate that is minus sin theta. It is cot theta and it is tan theta because 10 and quad are positive. So here 10 and quad are positive and others are can write in a negative form. So sec is cosec theta and cosec 270 minus theta is sec theta. So these are the formula related to 270 minus theta. Similarly you can write 270 plus theta and this is the category number of 7. You can write 270 plus theta. Okay, 270 plus theta. So here, how to write 270 plus theta? As you see, 270 related, all t ratio are alternate. Alternate means here, sine we can write cos. If we write cos, that is sine, okay? But we have to put this sine also. So here, 270 plus theta, 270 above, that means 270 plus theta is a lies in the fourth quadrant. So in the fourth quadrant, cos and sec are positive and other are negative. So here the given values is sine, so we make a sign negative because only cos and sec are positive. Sorry, but here the second value is cos 270 plus theta. 270 plus theta, here the value is cos, but cos and sec are positive. So that is the positive value. Okay. Similarly, you can write 10 that is minus cot theta minus 10 theta because 270 related are alternate. So we write in alternate form. Sec is also cosec because cos and sec are positive. So we write in positive form. And the last one is minus sec theta. So these are the T ratio regarding 270 plus theta in terms of. Theta, okay. Now, proceed to formula number 8, and that is 360 related. All these are formula in 0 degree, 90 degree, 180 degree, and 270 degree. So, now we make a formula regarding 360 degree, or we can write 2 pi. 2 pi minus theta or we can write 360 degree minus theta. Both are self. It is in a degree form and it is in a radian form. So you can write in a radian form. Okay. Suppose you write sin 2 pi minus theta. So that is 360. So 360 related are same. Same means sin is then sine. Now we put a sign positive or negative. 2 pi minus theta, that means 360 minus theta. 360 degree minus theta, it lies in fourth quadrant. 
in four polar cos and sec are positive, but here the value is sine, so it is negative. Similarly, cos 2 pi minus theta is cos 3 because it is positive, cos and sec are positive. Similarly, tan 2 pi minus theta is minus tan theta, cot 2 pi minus theta is equal to minus cot theta, sec 2 pi minus theta is equal to positive because their cos and sec are positive so here sec sec theta okay and cos sec 2 pi minus theta is equal to minus cos theta so in 2 pi related or 2 360 related all the t ratio are same so the values are same values but changes the sign of changes the sign means here it lies in fourth quadrant, so in fourth quadrant cos and sec and positive. So here you can see cos and sec are in the positive form and what other t ratios are in negative form. So these are the formula regarding 360 degree minus theta. Now we have to make a formula 360 plus theta or we can say 2 pi plus theta. Okay, so now make a formula 360 plus theta. So 360 plus means 360 above and 360 plus theta means it lies in first quadrant. As you see in first quadrant all are positive. So all these are in positive. So 360 related all are same so same means sign is given value sign the answer is sign so all these are same so we write in same and as you know 360 plus 360 plus means it lies in first product in first product all are positive so all these values are all the ratios are in positive form so these are the t ratios regarding 360 plus theta so here we have 90 related 90 related means 90 plus theta 90 minus theta in 180 180 minus theta 180 plus theta and 270 minus theta 270 plus theta and lastly 360 minus theta and 360 plus theta now we have to learn another formula that is a simple and common formula to learn how to make an obtuse angle in an acute angle. So next we have to learn T ratios on above 180 degree or we can say pi radian. When a given question above 180 degree, so how to convert in an acute angle? Acute angle means less than 90. Okay. So here we make a formula that is sine n pi plus theta that is equal to minus 1 to the power n sin theta cos n pi plus theta and it's also minus 1 over n cos theta and 10 n pi plus theta that is equal to you can write directly n theta because 10 n pi plus theta are all positive so in sine and cos um, minus 1 over n because it depends on the power if you know odd then it is negative if it is even then it is positive so these are the three primary formula regarding sine cos n and other three or can, can be written as in this form okay so how to convert so now take an examples suppose 10 minus 950 degree so we have to convert them in a good angles 10 minus 950 degree okay 
So now here are the negative values, negative angles. So tan of minus theta is you log tan of minus theta is minus tan theta. So first we may minus tan 950 okay so first we have to the values the angle allied angles converted to positive so 10 of minus 3 to minus 10 theta. so here 10 950 degree minus of 10 950 degree because it is an 80 180 degree above now we have to convert in a up to the acute angle so here we have to divide 950 degree divided into 180 degree. So here we multiply into 5, then you get 900, the remainder is 50 degree. Okay. If we divide 180, then we the question is 5 and the remainder is 50. So it can be written as in the form 950 is can be written as 5 into 180 plus 50 950 degree can be converted or it can be according to equality in the algorithm it can be written as 5 into 180 plus 50 so here minus 10 5 pi plus 50 degree okay according to this formula 10 and pi plus theta is equal to 10 theta so here theta is 50 so you can write minus 10 50 degree. So we convert 10 minus 950 degree at a acute angle that is minus 10. 10 9 minus 950 degree is equal to minus of 10 50 degree. Okay, now take another example. Suppose Find the value of sine 960 degree. What is the value of sine 960 degree? First, we have to divide, as you know, 960 degree is above 180. So, here 960 degree is divided into 180. So you could divide when it is the question is 5 and 900 and the remainder is 60. So it can be written as sine n pi plus theta that is 5 pi plus 60. You can write pi or 180. Okay. Both are same. So we can write in equilibrium form that is sine 5 pi plus 60. As you know sin n by plus theta is equal to minus 1 to the power n into sin theta so here the n in each 5 so according to this formula that is we can write minus 1 to the power 5 into sin 60 degree so the value of minus 1 to the power 5 is negative because the power is odd so we can write minus 1 and the value of sin 60 is According to standard angle tables, sine 60 is root 3 by 2. So the answer is minus 1 3 by 2. So the value of sine 960 degree is minus 1 3 by 2. So in this way, when we solve to above 180 degree as an equity angle. So this is the procedure to solve this case. So have a nice day. Thank you.